All right, thank you very much. So I'm standing here or sitting here with a special guest. It's Bruce Bowser of AMJ Campbell. You are the CEO. Thank you very much for joining me. Pleasure to be here. Thank you. Tell me a little bit about uh, what you're doing here today, a little bit about what AMJ Campbell is all about. A a AMJ Campbell um, has been part of the, this community for a number of years. And uh, in particular today, we're celebrating the Canadian military and acknowledging um, some of the folks that have come out to, to the game. So we've had a, a long-standing relationship with the, with the Canadian military. I was involved in a, um, setting up a charity called Canada Company that raises money to provide scholarship funds for children of fallen soldiers. So um, we've got, um, over the course of the last four years, raised several million dollars to help fund that. So pretty cool initiative. And, you know, I think when um, yeah, myself personally, uh, I grew up in, in, the, in a military family. Uh, Scott Abbott, who owns the team here, has been a big supporter. He's been involved in uh, an annual charity we do at, at his golf course to raise money for them. So it was a neat fit. We're a sponsor of the Brampton Battalion to, to do this our second year and have military families come out. Uh, it's very cool for us. And today, uh, especially cool, I don't know if you caught it, but the dropping of the puck was one of our office managers, Kathy Harwood, whose son is going over to Afghanistan. So it was just extra special today to do this. So it's uh, you donated 100 tickets to the Canadian Forces members. You were here as well uh, last year. How many years have you been doing this now? This is our second year of doing this event with the Brampton Battalion. But we've done it at, at um, other community arenas and events um, across the country where we've, we've encouraged our branches to have military nights. And I think a lot of corporations and a lot of um, organizations in Canada are doing the same thing where they're trying to recognize um, you know, the, the efforts of the military. There are so few vets left, World War I, World War II vets, of course. It's so important to get the word out to people, you know, just to understand the importance of this and getting involved in the community. Yeah, I think it's, um, you know, unfortunately when we're in conflict and we're losing soldiers, it creates um, awareness. And one of the things that our organization is trying to do is to make sure that um, you know, even when our soldiers come home from conflict, that we still have that level of pride and support for the military and their families, and, and we've had a lot of success with it. So very exciting for us, and we're glad that we can be a little part of it. Oh, thank you very much, Bruce. Really appreciate you being here and chatting with me this afternoon. Our, our pleasure. Thank you. All right, enjoy the rest of the game, because we do have the second period coming up right after this.